How important is this ABM podcasting to continually refine your overall corporate strategy and how you're approaching the market? What I've really appreciated out of the podcast, ABM podcast, is it's been a way we've been able to keep a voice of the market happening and coming in constantly. To us, to kind of feed in hot topics, messaging, positioning, just the lexicon they're using to talk about these things we get access to. The insights into those accounts in a sales cycle, the insight into the accounts we can't get into a sales cycle, but just having that voice of the market coming back to us so we can be more strategic, more considered, right? We've got this broader perspective of the market than we can get from a survey, from an NPS score, from a sales marketing meeting, from a product marketing meeting. It's giving us a broader, more strategic picture of what's going on in the marketplace and what matters to the market we want to serve. It's not always the list of features or benefits on the product marketing brochure, right? They're higher order things that are affecting their decision-making process and the priorities they set. This is helping us stay in tune, in sync with those things and understanding those when we go into a sales conversation.